Hey everybody, Baird here. Welcome to a new video for today. I'm here with my friend Kiki. How are you doing, Kiki? She's just hanging out. So as you guys know, I haven't posted a video in the past two weeks or so, and there's a reason for that, so let me explain that real quick, and then we'll get into the video. So over the past two and a half months, I've been working non-stop, literally 12 hours a day, creating a course for you guys. Well, actually, I've been making YouTube videos and all that too as well, but I've been working non-stop creating a program that I think you guys will absolutely love. Now, this program is an A to Z blueprint on how I built my Shopify store. Everything is in this one program, full transparency. I show you Facebook ad sets that literally turn $11,000 into $47,000, $7,000 to $30,000. I show you guys absolutely everything. Like I said, full transparency, I show you guys all the winning products that I was selling. I show you who I was targeting, my ad copy, my Facebook ad campaign, literally everything I break down so you guys can see it in its most simple form. So you guys can actually see what it takes to create a successful Facebook campaign. So it's not just somebody sitting there telling you guys what you should do. It's me explaining, this is how I've done it, this is how it works, and this is how I've implemented it into my own businesses and look at the results. Now, like I said, it's a creation in progress. It's only going to be getting better as I add more content every single week. There's so much in this course that I can't even begin to start to tell you guys what's actually in it or else it would take the whole video and I don't want it to do that. But for the past two and a half months, I've been really perfecting this course, making it as nice as possible. I've been having beta testers give me honest feedback and then using that feedback to refine the course even more to make it as nice as possible for you guys. And I've already been getting amazing feedback. So I'm really excited to release this. It was released this Easter weekend. I released it initially on my Instagram for all you guys who are following me on my Instagram, but I have yet to release it to my YouTube channel. So this is the first video that I'm talking about it. So guys, if you're interested, you can always message me on Instagram at Baird Strudwick. You can always email me Baird at BairdMentors.com or you can click on the link and there'll be a video of me explaining absolutely everything that I include in that one program. And you can see everything that's inside the program on that webpage. This is literally just the beginning. This course is going to become so, so amazing. It's going to blossom into something absolutely wonderful. So what I'm going to do is for all you guys who want to sign up for the first week, I'm going to keep it at the same price it is right now. This is the initial release price. But for all you guys who are interested, DM me on Instagram. I'm more than happy to answer any of your questions, but this is the initial release price, and then the price will go up. Like I said, there's 80 plus in-depth videos. I have case studies. I have so much actually in this one program, so I'm so proud of what I'm releasing to you guys. And I truly believe that you guys, when you enroll, will absolutely love it as well. So that being said, I just want to let you guys know about the program that I've been working on for the past two and a half months. Now it's finally out. I'm so proud of it, and I can't wait for you guys to join. First link in the description, now let's get on into the video. All right, so before we begin actually looking at the winning products that I've selected, I wanna go over a quick winning product checklist. So a winning product is a product that one, solves a problem, two, sparks an emotion. I'll go over all these after I list them. Three is an impulse buy, four, makes life easier, you know, provides value, five, has great resale potential, and six is a product that is in demand. So first off, a product that solves a problem. If you guys don't know, let's just say, for example, there's this one product that everybody used to sell back in the day that still is selling very well, especially right now. Actually, it's a product that you could probably sell if you wanted to, although there's probably a little competition. It might be a little saturated. Is this one dog water bottle? So if you guys look at the picture right here, you'll see this. It's like a it's like a basic water bottle that has a little bowl at the bottom of it for dogs to drink out of. So it's amazing because it solves a problem. One, if you're out with your dog that day and you know it's a hot day out and there's no water around you, you have a water bottle. Now that dog can drink, you know, they're hydrated. Now number two is sparks in motion, you could start your ad off by saying 10,000 dogs every summer die due to dehydration or something like that. Some kind of crazy fact that dog owners, when they look at, are going to be like, oh, wow, I don't want my dog falling into that category, that statistic of dogs that die due to dehydration during the summertime. So I want to get this water bottle. It solves a problem. My dog won't die, you know, out of dehydration. I'm now really emotional because I don't want my dog to die. I love my dog. You know, my, I've had my dog for 15 years, whatever. I'm not going to let you dehydrate. Anyways, it's it sparks an emotion, you know. Dog owners see that product and they're like, wow, I would never, ever put my dog in danger of getting dehydrated, you know? So I'm gonna buy this product. No, I'm gonna buy 10 of these products because one of these water bottles isn't enough. So that product, you know, solves a problem, it sparks an emotion, and it's an impulse buy. So that's the third one, impulse buys. People are scrolling through Instagram, scrolling through Facebook. The reason why they're on social media to begin with Instagram and Facebook is not to buy products. They're on social media to be on social media, you know, to interact with their friends, to look at posts, to post cute pictures of their Coachella experience or whatever they're on social media for. They're not on social media to buy a dog water bottle. But if you you can put that product in front of the right customer, make it an impulse buy, you know, they'll stop scrolling, they see that product, they're like, oh wow, you know, 10,000 dogs die each summer, I have a dog, it solves a problem with this product, you know, and now I don't have to worry about my dog getting dehydrated, that's how you get customers to buy. But let's just say I have deodorant and I want to advertise deodorant, okay? One, deodorant, it does solve a problem, you know, you don't stink. Two, it sparks an emotion. You could ask if they've ever smelt somebody who, you know, has really bad body odor or something like that, I don't know, you get them thinking about bad body smells. 
Three, it's an impulse buy because you need, you know, you need deodorant. Four, this product makes life easier, provides value just like that dog water bottle. But the problem with this product is that one, it solves a problem, but you can get it anywhere. Two, it sparks an emotion, but it's not really an emotion that gets people to buy. Three, people might need deodorant, but it's not necessarily an impulse buy. They're not gonna see that and be like, I need deodorant, and they're probably gonna go to their grocery store or whatever to get deodorant. So that's actually another bonus I want to add to it. You want to find products that you can't go to your local Walmart and pick up. So a winning product, you know, really does all of these, falls into all of these different categories, but also is not available at your local Walmart or your local retail store because that makes that product that much more special. Because nobody wants to wait one week to three weeks to get their product if they can go down five minutes on the road and get it from Walmart. So number four, it makes life easier. Having a dog water bottle makes life easier because I don't have to carry around a big jug of water. Now I have this one cute little water bottle that I just have to go down there, put it in front of my dog's mouth, squeeze it a little bit, and there's a little bowl of water that he can drink out of, or she can drink out of, in this case, huh, Kiki? Anyways, that product has great resale value. Number five has great resale potential. So if I'm selling that one dog water bottle, I want to make sure that I'm buying it for a cheap price and I can mark it up for a price that still will make people want to buy. So if I can get that doggy water bottle for five bucks on AliExpress and I can sell it for 25 bucks on my website, then that's, you know, that's good margins. I want to make sure I at least get 18 to $20 margin on my products. Anything below that is really just limiting yourself from being profitable with Facebook ads or with Instagram influencers because obviously the less margin you have for profit, then the less profit you're going to make. So you need to make sure your, your product has a great resale potential and the value that you market up as will still be in demand. So that goes into the number six, the product needs to be in demand. There needs to be demand for that product. Nobody's going to want to buy deodorant from your website because they can go to their local grocery store and get deodorant. It's, it's not like it's that in demand. A great example would be, I'm not going to sell winter coats to people in California in the middle of the summertime because there's no demand for that product. I'd rather sell bathing suits or any kind of summer product because obviously California in the summertime is not cold, it's really hot, so I'm not going to do well if I sell jackets, winter coats, fleeces, all that. That product is not in demand. Maybe during the winter months, it might be a little bit more in demand, but during the summertime in California, nobody's gonna wanna buy that unless they're going to Switzerland for three weeks and going skiing. It doesn't matter, there's no demand for that product. All right, so now that we've gone over the winning product checklist, we can now start to go into the actual winning products that I've found for you guys. So all these products that I've found fall into these categories, and I'll explain that when I go on to each individual product. So the first one, is now i found this product scrolling through my facebook feed about a week or so ago if you scroll down right here you can see 22 million views in about three weeks so this product is absolutely taking off this is a brand new store they made a one product store specifically for this product i'll actually open it up in a new tab to show you guys but this store is completely taking off they're selling it for around 40 dollars and we're getting it for around seven dollars to nine dollars so around ten dollars let's just say free shipping to the united states and they're selling it for a thirty dollar markup and this has 22 million views over a thousand comments 1800 shares 4.1 thousand likes and it's doing very well i assume because of the amount of engagement this post has so this product is amazing because one as it warms up more and more bugs insects and all that will be coming out because that's just part of summer and getting warm out outside so this product solves a problem this is an automatic really nice looking luxurious mosquito trap and it kills them and it traps them down here in this little collector thing in the video you can make little mosquito noises you know that really annoying noise when it's really close to your ear you could do that so they could be like oh i absolutely hate mosquitoes that's horrible i hate that sound but this product solves that problem so you will not get any more mosquitoes in your house if you have this up in your bedroom you could even go ahead and say you know you could set one of these up in your bedroom one of these up in your living room one of these up in your kitchen so you buy multiple you know get that bulk discount right here and now you won't have any more mosquitoes in your house. So that solves a problem, sparks an emotion, is an impulse buy, people really can see themselves using this product, it has great resale value, it makes their life easier because now they don't have to deal with mosquitoes, and it is in demand. So it, it's it really good, this is a winning product. And now if we wanted to, we could actually see how well this one supplier is selling this product. So I can go over here, copy this URL, copy it, go over to my AliExpress, go, click on right here, in my AliExpress, click on Drop Shipping Center, and then paste that one URL right here into, under the product analysis. If the Drop Shipping Center isn't available, then it takes two minutes to set it up, it's really quick. Paste the link, and it'll show you how many units are being moved out of that one supplier each day. So you can see right here, Big Peak 199. It's slowly increasing, you know, 93, 99, 100, and then it spiked down, but it still was above where it was over here. So you can see there's a slow uptrend, and then it starts really trending up. So 20th on 420, 117, 421, 132, 
422, 186. This product is going to continue to go up in demand as you know the summer months continue to get closer and closer. So this product is a really good product to sell. If you want to add this to your store, I, I recommend it. All right, so the next product is a fish scale remover. It's really simple right here. You can see you just scrape it up against a fish and it removes all the scales. We get it for around a dollar. Great for chefs. It's great for anyone who loves to cook. It's great for anyone who's in the seafood industry. This product is, you know, it's a, it's a really cool product. It's very simple. Now think about how this product would fall under every single category that I mentioned in the winning product checklist, or this product could be a great upsell. So let's just say you're selling another kitchen item that has to do with uh, fish or any kind of seafood. You could use this product so saying you buy that one product, get this product for free because it's only cost us around a dollar or so. Or we could do a little upsell. So they buy a product, you could say you get this product for 50% off and you can make this price only $10 or so. And then if they choose yes, then you make you know an extra eight bucks or so on your order. So that's that. The next product is this one scuba diving mask. This is a full face scuba diving mask. This is also another product that I saw on my Facebook feed. It was another video that had around 10 million views or so and it made a lot of sense because this product is, you know, it's in demand. Summertime's coming around, snorkeling's coming around, water activities are coming around. And this is just a cool product that is, you know, it's a little bit better than a snorkel mask, and you can you can mark it up as a more luxurious snorkel mask. Now, before I sell any product that has to do with safety, I make sure that I add proper disclaimers. Now, think about other products that would do well similar to this. You know, this is just one product in the ocean or beach kind of niche. So if we look at the uh, order count, we can go down here, drop shipping center, product analysis, put in the URL right here. You can see right here it's a little wavy, but it's in demand. So on the 20th, 35, 21st, 39. 22nd, 106. So as it becomes warmer and warmer out, I think this product will continue to pick up in demand because obviously it's a summer product. So if you're wanting to sell this product, think about adding it to your store. You can see literally right now, right around this time of the year, every single year it spikes around end of April, early May or June, it spikes up. So right now we're, we're about to spike, I believe, but that product would do amazing in you know summer stores, any kind of aquatic store, any kind of a nautical store, any kind of beachy store that would do very well in because that product falls into those categories and it's about to become in demand. So this one right here is more luxurious. You can see it has like a cool little halo mask almost. You can get this one for $34, but let's just say you want to add this product to your store. If you're already selling the other snorkel mask and you want to add an even better one, so you can make that other snorkel mask 60 bucks or so and you can make this upgraded premium one around $100 or so and you can mark this up to a really, really good price and make a lot of money off of it. So I just got a video of somebody just swimming with it on. These are cool products, you know, they, they're very impulse buys, they they solve a problem, they're in demand, they make life easier, now you don't have to go up and down when you snorkel, it's a full face snorkeling mask. So the next product right here is a little bit safer, they're these garden gloves that have claws on the end of their fingertips that you can use to dig into the ground. I find this product really cool, it is dirt cheap, so look right here, we can find these products for around $2, the markup potential of this is great. Now this product really solves a problem, now you don't even have to use garden tools, you can just use your hands and that makes everything so much easier. So this product really solves the problem, makes life easier, is in demand, is of impulse buy, and it just falls under every single category that we talked about. So if we go into Google Trends right here, we can see in gardening, we are picking up on trends right now. It's springtime, so we're about to peak with gardening. This product will be in demand for as long as it's warm out and as long as people are gardening. So this product is very great. It's very cheap and you can sell it for a marked up price. And a video ad for this product would do absolutely wonders because you can see the product in use, you can see how they use it. Now going into our last product right here, I really love this product actually, it's one of my favorites. It is a fast, repairable phone charger. So I'll play a video right here, it'll do more justice than me just explaining it. Charger, it works, he unplugs it, and then what you can do is you can literally cut the cable. So this guy's going to get some scissors, he's going to cut the cable. You know, normal iPhone cables, they fray, they get really fr they get really nasty, and you can't use them anymore, but this one uh, phone charging cable, you can literally cut the cable, you can take it out, and then you can put it back in the tip where you plug into your phone, you can put that back into it, and then it works just like new. So iPhone, their biggest problem is they do not have good cables, they like to fray at the very end, so this product completely fixes that problem. So if your cable starts to fray, you can just literally cut it, take the top off, put it back on, and now you have a brand new charging cable, and this product is only $3.12. So if I wanted to sell this, I could sell this as a deluxe repairable iPhone charger, and that could be $20 to $30, like I said. So that's a $20 to $30 profit margin, and this product solves a problem. You can use a normal iPhone cable as an example, as a you know a really frayed iPhone cable, and then this, just cut it, 
and then replace it. An iPhone cable, you cut it and now it's useless. So there's so many cool ways you can advertise this one product. The margins are great. It's for iOS, Android, and for Type-C. And this product will always be in demand because people will always have iPhones. I actually bought one for myself off Amazon so I could see how well it worked to create a new unique video ad for this one product to help me stand out from anyone else advertising this. All right, everybody, so those are a couple products that I think are winning products for this time of the year. Now, let's just say I want to find an advertisement similar to that one gardening gloves product or any of those products I just mentioned. You can go into Facebook, you can go into your search bar, click on the search bar and type in quotations, gardening gloves or repairable phone charger cable or full face snorkeling mask. You can type in any kind of product that you want to sell in that one Facebook search bar, click on videos, click on 2019 or 2018 under the date posted, and you can see video ads for that one product being used. So those are all great examples that you can use when you want to create your own advertisement. You can see how they sell the ad, you can see what they have in the video, you can see how they have formed their description, how they form the caption, you can see how well that video ad performs. So I would suggest only looking at the videos that have great engagement for good examples, because that will tell you guys that the product is being you know sold profitably. And you can also use all of these keywords when you want to search in your one Facebook search bar. So, and also don't forget the Google Plus Shopify method. So if you want to search that one product, I could type in Google full face snorkeling mask plus Shopify, and it will only give me Shopify stores that are selling that one product. Now I can go into their Shopify store, see what their description is, see what they're using for photos, see how they're completely laying out their website. I could literally see everything they're doing successfully, model that and use that into my own store, implement that on my own store. And that's how you become successful. So guys, that sums up for today's videos. Those are five products. I think I actually added a couple more, but those are a couple products, mainly five, that I believe are winning products, especially as the weather starts to warm up and it becomes warmer and warmer and you know summertime comes around, those products will do very well. So once again, the first link in the description will be the Ecom Blueprint Masterclass. I would love to see you guys inside there. So feel free to check it out. DM me if you have any questions about it. My Instagram, once again, is at Baird Strudwick. And you can also email me, Baird at BairdMentors.com. I would love to get back to you guys. So if you have any questions whatsoever, email me or DM me. And I'll get back to you within 24 hours or so. I'm not going to say my team will get back to you because I am my team. I will get back to you within 24 hours. You'll be receiving an email from me. I really think it's important to reach out to you guys personally, not have somebody who I've hired to reach out to you. Now, that being said, thank you guys for watching one last time. Please give me a thumbs up. It really helps out. Subscribe if you haven't. So that's it. Thank you for watching. I'll see you in the next video. Video. Peace out.